the lecture number eight. Okay, again we are just talking about the different. Uh, <coughs> Before coming in this lecture, you must go in my previous lecture. Then your concept it will be clear that why, what is the meaning of integral and how we are using it and the simple integration how to solve it. Okay, so in this <coughs> question I have I am again solving the double integration. Okay. But by the help of change of order, okay. So what is the meaning of this? Again, I am explaining you uh, what he has written here. So <coughs> he has given you something x. It means that its meaning is he has given you y is equal to x square upon 4a, and that is y is equal to 2 square root a x. Okay. So it means that if this is y is equal to, then definitely it will be x is equal to. Okay. That is x is equal to 4a. and this is dy dx okay this is meaning of this okay now if he has written this one x is equal to 0 to you have to integration means you have to count total number of points from this to this okay what is x is equal to 0 x is equal to 0 is this 2 x is equal to 4a x is equal to 4a is this it means that you have to count the total number of points from here to here okay so in this condition everything will be come okay but we have to count Total number of points inside this shadow part. Okay, so this is the meaning of this only. Okay, you have measured only the this uh, this portion. Okay, so now after then he has written x at y is equal to something. What is this actually? This is actually he has given you this one. Y square is equal to this and y. <coughs> he has given you y square is equal to four a x. It means that y is equal to plus minus square root four a x. It means that that is plus minus two square root a x, but minus will not come. Why? Because if we are in the positive quadrant, that is the positive plus plus quadrant. Okay, this is the plus plus. So we will remove this one negative. Okay, so you have this y is equal to something. Okay, y is equal to something. Okay, so after then he has given you something. Okay, so he has given you x square is equal to four a y. It means that y is equal to x square upon 4a. That is the second value. Okay, this. So what he is doing? He is doing at first x is equal to zero to x is equal to 4a. X is equal to zero. That is x is equal to zero and that is 4a. X is equal to 4a. So he is counting total number of points from here to here. Integration means you are counting total number of points from here to here. You are adding total number of points from here to here. It means that you are using the summation. Summation means the integration. Okay. So now from here to here. After then you are using y is equal to something. What is y is equal to? Y is equal to this. And what is this? This is this. And what is this? This is this. Okay. So it means that after then you are counting total number of points from here. to this one because of the second <coughs> curve is this from here from here to this here to this okay it means that from here this curve to this curve so the sided portion it is coming are you looking my sided portion okay at first we use this to this then after then this portion to this portion okay so this sided portion uh, you are finding the sided portion total how many points How many pixels inside this shaded portion? Okay, so this now we have to use the change of order. Actually, what is the change of order? In the change of order, there are many books. They have written different, 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 different uh, methods. Okay, I am just writing something very simple logic. Okay, what will you uh, do for the change of integration? Only one thing. the concept that is same whatever i have just taught uh, teach you okay and you have to change only the this x axis and y axis then after this something will happen here i will just uh, explain you so what we have to do we in this condition change uh, change of order only one thing in this condition th this is the x axis now you will think that this is not x axis This is y axis. Okay, we are changing. Okay, and this is the y axis. This is not y axis. This is the x axis. When you are replacing in place of x, you are replacing y. In place of y, you are replacing x. What will happen in this condition? In this condition, this will also change. And at in this condition, if this is x axis, then this is y is equal to zero. And uh, this is y uh, x axis. Then this will also change. In this condition, this is y is equal to four a. Okay. 
so this change this change we have used this one and also we have used this and this in this condition this will also change this will also change in this condition this will be y square is equal to 4 a x okay and also this will also change in this condition this will be x square is equal to 4 a y okay so now now our integration this integration it will be totally changed so what will happen in this condition so what we have done let's look here at first what we have taken x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 4a what we have done at first we have done x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 4a okay x is equal to 0 to x is equal to 4a x is equal to 0 to x we have total number of count we have from here to here okay similarly again we are doing in place of this this okay this is y is equal to 0 and y is equal to in place of this we are taking y is equal to 4a y is equal to 4a very simple now after then uh, after then what we have done uh, from here to here after that at first we count from here to here and after then we count from here to here okay so what is this this is we have taken this one y is equal to this one okay what is this go 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 okay in place of this we have taken this one so now for for this for this uh, this is y is equal to it means that this is x is equal to so x is equal to means y square upon 4a okay very simple x is equal to y square upon 4a now after then what we have done at first we have counted from here to here then after then here to from here to here okay from here to here okay we are just using the, we are finding this portion from this curve we have written okay then now what about this one this one is before it was y square is equal to 4x now this one is this but here we have to write for x is equal to so what is x is equal to square root 4a y what is square root 4a y square root 4a y means 2 square root a y nothing and after then this both are same now you can evaluate very simple very very simple don't go in your book in the market there are many authors they have written a lot of concept okay that is the best method <coughs> what they have given you change the x-axis and y-axis according to x-axis and y-axis these uh, function it will be also change whatever they have written at first you have to understand actually what is this and same pattern you have to write here okay same rule only you have to change the pattern line before it was x is equal to something now it is y is equal to something before it was y is equal to something now it is x is equal to something now you can find it in the previous lecture we have explained how to find the integration okay now you can calculate this is very simple okay so and if you want then i will also calculate it no problem so you know that that is a constant constant integration means so this is x is equal to something okay and this is y is equal to something so it means that at first you have to calculate y okay so this is y is equal to 0 and y is equal to 4a and this integration is y then after then you have to put sorry this is uh, x okay in place of x you have to put this one x <coughs> integration of x is equal to integration of uh, integration of dx is equal to x okay so you have this and this is x is equal to y square upon 4a okay and this is x is equal to 2 square root a y then after then you will get 2 square root a y minus y square upon 4a in place of x you put this value okay then after then 0 to 4a okay then this is uh, dy now integrate it you will get the result this is very simple okay so if you integrate then you are getting uh, 2 I am just solving here okay I am solving here okay then you are getting uh, 2 okay this is 2 then square root a it will come outside and square root y if you will square root y then you will get y key power 3 upon 2 
ओके अपॉन थ्री अपॉन टू अपॉन थ्री अपॉन टू माइनस माइनस देन यू आर गेटिंग दिस इज वाई क्यूब वाई क्यूब अपॉन फोर ए अपॉन फोर ए इन टू फोर थ्री जा ट्वेल्व फोर थ्री जा ट्वेल्व ओके सो यू आर गेटिंग दिस वन सो नाउ यू विल पुट द होल वैल्यू इट इज जीरो टू फोर ए ओके दिस इज वेरी सिंपल नाउ पुट देन यू विल गेट दिस रिजल्ट दिस इज सिक्सटीन ए स्क्वायर अपॉन थ्री सेम क्वेश्चन आई हैव सॉल्व इन लेक्चर नंबर सेवन गो टू द लेक्चर नंबर सेवन आई हैव एक्सप्लेन ऑलरेडी दिस क्वेश्चन ओके सो दिस इज डेडिकेटेड ओनली द चेंज ऑफ ऑर्डर आई थिंक दैट यू लर्न इफ यू आर फेसिंग एनी प्रॉब्लम ओके जस्ट पॉज द वीडियो अगेन वॉट एवर आई हैव टॉट यू अगेन पॉज इट लिसन पॉज इट लिसन इफ यू आर फेसिंग एनी प्रॉब्लम देन यू कैन आस्क मी ओके थैंक यू सो मच